Yo, how is everyone doing today? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Superior. And um, what are you guys are looking at on the screen right now is the best, at least in my opinion, the best class with the Honey Badger. Now, this is a video requested, um, so I thought I'd get it out to you guys as soon as possible um, because I've uploaded so many Honey Badger gameplays already that I know you guys are anxious for a class setup because um, you because you guys know that I've gotten success with this weapon and you know why can't you guys get success with it too so looking at the class setup the honey badger with grip and extended mags is definitely by far the best attachments I don't care what anyone else says these are my favorite and what I find the most useful now for the perks I like to use quick draw dead silence amplify focus and hardline now quick draw dead silence amplify and focus are all the perks to me that I need on every single class no matter what just because with Astro A40s the amplify perk makes it very easy to find out where the enemies are and I just can't seem to win a gunfight without quick draw dead silence because you know if my footsteps are loud how do I expect to hear other people's footsteps and focus just because I can't seem to win a gunfight without that or quick draw and hardline also helps me get all of my other strike packages early and when and the biggest reason for having hardline on is I can get assist counts as kills so for every uh, two assists it counts as one kill on my streak so that definitely helps because I think one time I got um, I had a total of 17 kills and um, let me see like 14 assists and I was able to get a KEM um, so that's absolutely crazy um, but as far as the specialist strike package goes, the first thing that I have is I unlock scavenger at three points. Um, scavenger is necessary. You know, you do not want to run out of ammo on a streak. That would be awful. And then sleight of hand's the next one, just because sleight of hand uh, it definitely helps you reload faster. And if you're in like up in their spawn, because by the time by six kills, you're probably somewhere near a lot of enemies, and you're gonna need to reload. And the twelfth one is one that I'm debating putting on my classes or not, and that is Deadeye. Now, if you guys are unaware of what Deadeye does, it is basically stopping power. But, you know, it does, has the same damage multiplier as stopping power, which would be an extra 40% to each bullet. But it there's only a certain chance that it, the bullet will have that. And when you're below three kills, I think it's like a one in nine shot that your bullets are going to do one in or 40 percent more damage and then above a five kill streak it's like one in every two bullets to do that 40 percent damage so it's definitely pretty much no use when you first get it but as you charge it up and as you get on a bigger streak it will do more damage um which definitely helps out a lot and then the um the bonus perks which is definitely you know there's a lot of different combinations you can do because in Call of Duty Modern for 3, which is when the special strike package was first introduced. Whenever you got that special bonus, you would have every single perk, and that's absolutely insane. And I really wish they brought that back in this game. But as far as the first perk I have, I have Stalker, just because it makes you feel like Superman being able to aim down your sight and just slide across the map. So it's definitely a perk that is not necessary, but definitely fun to have and worth putting on it, the bonus. Now, another one I have Takedown. Uh, Takedown, just a quick little one-slot perk, and definitely when you're playing against players who don't have really good headsets and can't hear you shooting your actual gun um, because you have the silencer you will be off the radar and if you can take down enemies and um, still you know have them have the skull not come up they're basically gonna never know that that teammate was ever there and ever died now the next one is blind die because it is nothing is worse than dying on a big streak by like a helicopter or something like that and the last one is blast shield because the only thing that's worse than dying from a helicopter on a big streak is dying from an ID on a big streak so every single perk that I have here is pretty much necessary in my eyes for building a big class but um like if you don't have a good headset like A40s or something like that then there really is no point in having amplify on unless you really like to crank that bad boy up and basically bro your eardrums out um, you know it's as you see right now in the gameplay is actually a KEM with the honey badger on overlord overlord's definitely one of my favorite maps it's, there's a lot of favorite maps in this game and, um, you know, Overlord is definitely one of them just because I know how to work that map so well. And because there are so many little metal things you can run on, like when any, whenever someone goes in a building, you just hear, like, metal footsteps. So Amplify really does come in handy in this map, um, especially with a good headset. And, you know, I'll say that once and I'll say it again. I recommend A40s more than any other headset I've ever owned. And, um, you know, if you don't have a good headset, don't plan on Amplify. You know, I'd rather substitute, you know, a better perk for it, like, um, I don't know, fully loaded or... ICU or you know blast shield or tech mask or anything like that um, you know basically this class isn't the best class it is the best class in my opinion but um, if you don't need quick draw and you'd rather have on stalker or incognito or something like that then by all means put that on you know I'm not I'm not any better of a player than any of you out there I can assure you that um, I just get lucky and play all day <laughs> 
But uh, that's about it for the class setup, guys. I really hope you guys do try this class out. And if there's anything you guys don't like about this class or some perk that you would swap out or anything like that, just leave it down below in the comment section. I'd be more than happy to check that out. And I, it fascinates me what you guys, what classes you guys like to use because um, it's classes I normally really don't use that much. And um, you know, it's fascinating to me. But um, that is about it for this video, guys. If you guys did enjoy, please click the subscribe button. It means the world to me. And uh, click the like button too. Let's go for 15 likes on this video. We've been getting an amazing amount of likes on the past video, and it uh, really puts a smile on my face. But other than that, guys, have a great day. It's been Superior here. Peace out.